Could you tell us the latest updates on the trophy protection system? So it's a, it's a good question. We are in the contract to supply more than uh, 1,000 systems for uh, the IDF uh, platforms, the Merkava Mark 4, Merkava Mark 3, Namer, and potentially uh, the Itan APS, APC, uh, and uh, under contracts with the uh, US Army to supply trophy uh, to uh, the Abrams tanks. This is an extensive effort together with our local partner, Leonardo uh, DRS. And now, based on this infrastructure, we are extending our efforts to uh, Bradley and uh, Stryker. We're using a lighter version uh, system, but the system is based on the same uh, principles and elements of uh, the current uh, trophy system. Uh, could you tell us uh, how it works, basically? So the system has a radar and a countermeasure that is based on EFPs, explosive formed penetrators. Uh, this uh, method of uh, hard kill uh, capability creates the lowest collateral effects, the lowest risk to dismounts and to platform. And this is proven by uh, the IDF, the US Army, and uh, in battles in Israel. There's no risk to dismounts around the vehicles, civilians, and the platforms themselves. And it's being extended from heavy armor to light vehicles? I would say that the trophy is suitable for vehicles like the Striker, 8x8 vehicles. There is no residuals that will put this vehicle, light skin vehicle, I would say, uh, at risk. This has been proven in tests and we are very proud by the opportunity that we have to demonstrate it to uh, the US Army on Striker. Thank you very much indeed.